Greetings from Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam. I am Dr. Nguyễn Thị Hiệp, and I represent Vietnam as a finalist in the ASEAN US Prize in Science competition for women. I am a lecturer in biomedical engineering at the International University, part of Vietnam National University, Ho Chi Minh City. I am teaching and doing research in the tissue engineering and regenerative medicine. In addition to receiving the Laurea UNESCO Scholarship for Women in Science, I have also taken part in various storm related conferences to promote the participation of the women in science. Urbanization in Vietnam is among the fastest in the region. Migration from the rural to the urban area puts a lot of pressure on the healthcare services in the biggest cities. Therefore, I believe that one of the most important factors to make urbanization sustainable is to establish smart city where the Internet of Things and the telemedicine system are well developed. With smart medical devices and biomaterials, it will be possible to take care of the people in their own homes. My work focuses on biomaterials such as bioglue and nutritious testosterone kits for wound healing that can be easily used to provide more effective first aid. Such products will also provide basic health care for those living in the remote areas. The reason I apply for ASEAN Science Prize for Women is to encourage more women to pursue their study in storm fields, particularly in regenerative medicine, which is quite new in Vietnam. Being a woman scientist engineer can be a great contribution to Vietnam. I believe that in addition to being recognized for their significant contributions to science, winners of this prize must also accept the responsibility to act as the role models for all women, especially young scientists, to encourage them to link their own work to the challenge of addressing our common problems, including unwanted side effects of private urbanization. I intend to continue my research on applications of telemedicine and the Internet of Things to help increase awareness pupil to unwanted side effects of private urbanization. As such, I hope that if I am selected for this prize, my work will be emulated within the ASEAN community and other developing countries. Thank you very much.